Hello and welcome. I don't know how I supposed to do this intro. After years of waiting. Because the Stalker 2 supposed to come out in 2012. That was over 10 years ago. But now it's here. And also you probably already see on the FPS on this corner that it's over 300. And that's because I have new graphics card. 490 with 24 gigs. And now, after very, very, very long silence on my channel, which I'm very, very sorry, because there has been so many things on my life going that I just haven't had any time of doing any videos. And uh, now, as I promised, when the first info that this game is gonna come out, I said, when it's come out, there's gonna be a video of that. And sadly, I need to take one my statement back that it's gonna be a stream that's gonna continue as long as this game. That is sadly not possible. And the sole reason for that is that this game is around over 200 hours long. As far as I know, it's too long to make one stream. But one more thing. This is not even the normal version of Stalker 2. This is not the deluxe edition of Stalker 2. This is so far the most highest price game what I have. No, it's not 60 euros, not 70, not 80, not 90, not 100, 110 euros. And it has everything. And if there's DLC coming on this game, but I really think it is in the future, I will get it free. Links to this game and all my social media links down below in the description. And now, after talking almost three minutes, let's go! Okay, difficulty. <clears throat> Rookie. Suitable for beginners and players who are more interested in the story. We probably gonna take this one. Stalker. Suitable for players looking for balance between story and combat and veteran who craves intense challenge in battles. And as far as I know, this one is already hard. So yeah, this is gonna be a very long series. Story mode. In this mode, combat is much less challenging, giving you a chance to explore game world even if you are not seasoned. Shoot the player for more balance, expert try right, the stalker difficulty, you get a taste of a rough and unforgiving zone, such as we envision it. Well, sadly, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the easy difficulty. Let's go! <sighs> there were so many challenges to get this thing done. And I'm gonna give you everything what happened between the last video, last stream and this one in upcoming update video. And we are in the burning house. We are touching a stone. Last 
question. Nah, Dr. Dalek. Are you sure the perimeter surrounding the zone is really enough? If a powerful emission were to occur, we would... Listen. The zone has remained stable for years. Besides, we didn't establish the most advanced institution in human history without first guaranteeing its safety. As the head of the Scientific Institute for Research of the Chernobyl area, or Circa for short, I believe the wonders that we will bring to the world far outweigh the potential risks. How big are these risks exactly? <laughs> the zone reveals a whole new world. We can stick with the old one, fearing change. But tell me, do you want our descendants to remember us as cowards? Or as those who dared to venture forward to a new, better humanity? Remind our listeners that a similar incident happened in our region quite recently, ruining homes and livelihoods. However, city officials urged people to stay calm, assuring them the situation is totally under control. Okay, a little bit glass box from the right people right there, right? Where there was that death truck. And if you haven't checked already, the three parts of the game might have all gone in the happy version. Okay, wakey wakey. Are you alive back there? Yep. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. Zone is really raging today. See that? It was a hell of a blast. Can't remember one. So fierce. Are we uh, close? Eh, kind of. <laughs> the central checkpoint could be on alert after the emission, but there's another way in. Crack in the wall to the left of the fault. Bugger off! Hope you didn't lose your secret artifact along the way. If it was outside the zone for too long, it would have lost its anomalous energy. <clears throat> but I've got this shiny metal thing to recharge it. One lucky activation and we have a gold mine here. Sector 9, visual detection of the fault. I say again, Sector 9, visual detection of the fault. Show me what you found. What the hell is this? I've seen artifacts taken from the zone before. They always burn out and fall apart real fast. But this one? This one is not from the zone. Oh, I bet. Where'd you find it? In my laundry basket. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Who do you think you're talking to, huh? You have any idea what this scanner cost me? If it's not an artifact, it's gonna blow us all to hell! I won't let my hard work come to nothing because of you. I won't let you push it down the shit up. This stone owes me a new home. We gotta move. Get to the scientist bunker. Nehoda will explain how to proceed with the scanner. He's waiting for you. Good luck. Okay, and now we are in the soul. Okay. Give me a C 
Top of scanner, anomaly detection scanner given me by Harman. What if I guess it was you who seen artifacts during such an experiment, but was disconnected due to the safety issue? But this, at this point, I got nothing to lo left to lose. Then we have non stop energy drink and a few medkits and ammo. One thing that I need to mention already that few people on the internet already was worried that hey, Will this game, because this is using the newest Unreal Engine as a game engine that can any computer actually run it? And yeah, it can. I'm not sure if you can see on this corner over 100 FPS. And no, this is not in 1080p. This is a little bit higher. Every setting on Epic, which is the highest setting what you can put. With DLSS and 4K. Probably in the next episode, I'm trying to get uh, the HDR on. So we're gonna see probably a difference then. But yeah, no problem whatsoever. Okay, so... Hmm. Okay, we have a flashlight. Okay. Damn, this is nice. I can't wait the morning to see what else we can see in the daytime. One thing that was I was a little bit worried though was before I even started recording this one, the only thing what I managed to do was checking the settings, but how well this game is actually running. Okay, we can uh, use the mouse scroll button to put the flashlight on. Nice. a bit worried that this is not gonna actually run with this high settings with the problems but apparently no worries at all I must say that just a wow okay what we have here can it food thank you here. Okay, we can use. Okay, let's take a peek. Okay, it's actually pretty freaking dark. I barely can see past the door. Probably the only team. On second left here, I'm going blind. They're in route, but we lost contact. Falcon 3, investigate the scientist's bunker. Probably the only thing what I can say which is pretty sad on the setting side is that you can't turn motion blur off. That is the only thing. Okay, there's a the body. Otherwise, that's bad for your health. Never let your guard down on the song. Okay, we get AK. Ammo and IPSFBDA. Well, not bad. Oh. 
let's keep moving. Okay, I think we are far enough that thing. <clears throat> I don't think that is coming here. But it's sure. That's for a driver. Okay, we need to go there. Let's see. Anything about the gun bag? Okay, I don't probably want, don't want to know what that thing is. Okay. Yeah, not going there. Okay, let's open the other door. Okay, quick access. Okay, okay. Let's eat. Okay, nice animation. Docker 3, we've got a breach at the Dugal. The bunker's off. Another ground team is on the way. South. I still don't have any maps. Stick to the perimeter. Avoid going in. I'll contact the sphere. Okay, main mission, side mission, enemy, and body. Okay, let's try to... Okay, that thing is now dead. Okay, let's check these houses and see what we can find. And also, let's reload the AK. Let's see, anything useful in here? Okay, a dead body. Okay, medkit and what is the bandage? Not bad. Okay, nothing else. Ooh, well, let's use that one and heal. And also, there is a lot of argument, so let's see how many we're gonna actually unlock on this game session. Well, this series. And there's gonna be a lot more this video, uh, this game come out, and this one is hopefully coming out on 20th business day evening, because the game developers wanted to release this one in different times in different time zones, probably because this game has a massive fan base. Okay, some shrooms in here. There's the bunker. Good. Okay, I'm on. Thank you. Easy. But I'll figure it out. Okay, left shift, quickly prevent on ladder. Okay. Oh yeah, they have given the original boxes in this game. Nice. If you have played the first or second or third Stalker game, the Shadow of Privat. Wait, set off Chernobyl. I don't remember the first game actual name right now. 
But the first one, then the Glare Sky, and then the Gold of Tribute. If you have played those, I must say, a lot of things have changed. A lot. Okay, can't get inside here, so... Wait. Ooh! Actually, we are going back now. I need to check one thing in here. Because in this direction, if I'm not totally wrong, there was that... Okay, not this side. Yeah, I'm not gonna... I don't wanna get any radiation though. Oh, we... Don't say that we can... Oh, come on, we can't get there. But yeah, in that uh, direction there is that outhouse. There is an ammo box. But sadly I missed it. <laughs> Because I didn't realize that we can use our knife to open it. Okay, let's check the outside if there's anything. Except for radiation. Well, let's get up. And let's open the hatch. And get inside and let's see what's gonna happen. Yep, this is where we need to go. Well, that is pretty massive. Okay, let's go inside and let's see. Okay, this is not a good sign. I see already two X's, three X's in here. What the fuck happened here? Yeah, okay, there is a blood. And bullet holes. Okay, and there is some drugs, okay. Actually, let's take the gun already. Ooh, thank you. Okay, thank you. And we get Echo Decket Detector to find artifacts. Nice. Okay, I don't see anything useful there. And there should be the third body. Okay, we get PDA, Dr. Nehoda's PDA. And so this medkit. Nice. Well, what is it? Any updates? The goat is dead. So are the other scientists. Stop freaking out and tell me where the data is stored. Find his laptop. The coordinates should be in there. Okay, we got a lot more stuff in here. Okay, so now we need to go yeah, back to that room and check the laptop. Which is pretty old one though. And that is actually their laptop. Hey Nagoda. What's up? Have you met Herman's client yet? Tell him a new emission means new coordinates. New coordinates means a new bill. <laughs> Nagoda's dead. I'm Mr. Client. Whoa! That's a hell of a mess you got there, boys. Well, Screw that smart-ass bastard. I never liked him anyway. Hold on a sec, Mr. Client. Did Herman at least tell you what to do with the coordinates? Hmm. Well, you can tell me. Remind me. Holy fucking cow. Will you let me eat in peace for once? No. All right. Follow the coordinates and stick your scanner into the ground. And then back off. When it's all done, you pick it up. Got it? Okay. If not, that's your problem. I'm not a damn help desk. So long, Mr. Client. Do you have the coordinates? I hope you do. Things are about to get a little more complicated from here. Good thing it's been a walk in the park until now. 
Okay, First, let's get that, that one thing. This one more thing. Here. Scientists ought to have at least one. Okay, we can sleep here. I've already got a detector. You'll need to acquire an artifact to shield yourself from the scanner's radiation. If you don't, you might end up joining the Gola. How? Find an anomaly. After the emission, it shouldn't be that difficult. Then use the detector's signal to navigate it. If the stalkers have figured it out, I'm sure you can too. After that, attach the artifact to your belt and go plant the scanner. Just try not to get killed in the anomaly. That would be rather embarrassing. Yep, and because we have echo de detector, I think we're gonna find more than one. Okay, let's see if we can see any movement. Okay, somewhere in this area. Okay, we have the PDA, but let's... And he gets slug! <laughs> Jesus! We are dead. <coughs> yeah. Well, first death in epi first episode. Good job for me. I must say, the night time will be hard. I literally almost get a freaking heart attack for that thing jumping out of no freaking nowhere. I must say, I didn't expect that. Good job, developers. Good job. After that, attach the artifact to your belt and go plant the scanner. Just try not to get killed in the anomaly. That would be rather embarrassing. Okay. Let's see. Okay, I'm just wondering how we gonna... Well, that was not my plan, though. Oh, this way, okay. Well, they already know that it's gone. And then let's just put that one there and before that make safe. <laughs> oh, well that was, was not part of my plan. Okay, so two max is not enough. Okay, I don't even know how hard the uh, last difficult will be if we are dying on the first enemy. <laughs> Actually, a second enemy. Okay. 
Because I haven't bind any save buttons yet, I need to go manually save things. But hey, at least we managed to kill this thing. God damn, it's ugly. Okay, and there should be a second one coming soon. Yeah, this place. Yeah, this place is not creepy at all. Okay, dead body. Okay. Take all, thank you. That one. So... Okay, 50 meters. Okay, I don't think that we can go to the water. So there has to be a other way. Oh, here. Yeah, there's probably nothing except radiation. A lot of radiation. Okay, 25, 20 meters. Okay, is that the thing? Yeah, we need to get the camera here. And let's hope the best that we are not gonna explode. Because that would be very, very sad. Okay. Is uh, charging always this noisy? No, but that rock of yours is pretty unusual. Check the scanner quick. Is it charged? Hmm. I think it is. No. Calm down. I've got some time left. Heading for the next spot. Okay, well, I think we get one down. Yeah, I think that was all the enemies. Okay, we got grenade and sausage, so I guess. Well, let's take all of that. Thank you. Oh, there we one more body. That's good, good, good. Okay, so no dead bodies. Next spot will be a little bit over 100 meters away.
okay, I have very freaking bad feeling about what that thing is. Welcome, claustrophobia. Okay, at least there is no spiders in here. Okay, there's already two dead bodies in here. Thank you. And the second one is here. Thank you. Okay, let's check here if we can see any enemies. No, except a lot of radiation. Okay, let's see. We have something. Yep, this one. Okay, and how can I? Okay, I guess this is the radiation mark that if it's full, we're gonna take so much radiation. Okay. <clears throat> let's put the thing and run. And hopefully this stunt is gonna actually work. out soon. Skiff! Are you there? The place is swarming with soldiers! They're gonna shut everything down and then you'll never get out of the zone! Just one spot Ooh. left. Did you hear me? You. Drop the damn scanner and come back right now! I've got nowhere to go back to, Herman. Over and out. Okay, let's see. Before anything else, I'm gonna make a new save. What the ball? Oh, well, so far, nobody has tried to shoot me yet. Okay, how are we gonna get there? Okay, there's one window we need to check that one out. be this one. Oh, there's something. Ammo, bandage, and a big safe. Well, let's take. Well, so far there's no bodies in here. Okay, and there's the thing. Okay, let's hope that the, the third time is the charm. I really hope that this is gonna work. Okay, I think it is! Okay... At least it's green and not... Uh, What's that? Some kind of anomaly? Uh, what? Uh, I see the scanner. Tracing for anomalous activity in radio signals. Situation unclear. You, inside. You, to the roof. Move okay. Up. So, three enemies. HQ, pullback reporting. 
to the zone, prologue complete, but this is so far the start. Nice argument name. Okay, and um, so the dog is a little eating us. Good morning. Okay, and there's the anomaly and that thing is exploded. What the f Whoa, whoa, whoa! Some fireworks, huh? Who are you? Yeah. I'm your guardian angel. Here's a bolt. Where the hell would I need a bolt? Take a look around. Oh, crap. Yeah. Toss it into the anomaly, then while it resets, run like hell. Got it? Now okay, go. Okay, okay. Not too many times on anomalies on three earlier games. Okay. You handled it like a real stalker. Come over here and let's talk. Sure hoped you would. <laughs> How'd you get here without any gear? Hmm. Okay, I was attacked. Let's go I was attacked that. while on a job. I got hit in the head, and when I woke up, I was in almost nothing but my birthday suit. You're lucky they didn't kill you right away. You should stop by Zalisa and check up with the doc man, and talk to the bartender while you're there. See if he knows anything about your attackers. We need to check the pardon out in this episode. Squint. Damn it, man. Because I have a feeling that we're gonna meet a very familiar face. Yeah, let's follow him. I don't think that he's gonna kill us. Not even kidding. You wanted to settle some scores, didn't you? Shit. The timing couldn't be any worse. Okay, at least we have the, the flashlight. The bastard shot him at point blank. Then took everything, even the sensors. Fuck. Now the entire lesser zone is gonna have to clean up this mess. Why is your ass still here? Head over to Zalicia and keep your mouth shut. Unless you want both of us killed. Okay, that guy's dead as well. Oh yeah, we are here! Didn't even recognize where we was. Okay, there is a big air balloon. Okay, any loot in here? 
literally anything will be worth now. Well, thank you, but we don't have a gun. But we have a at least. Oh, we have. Yeah, we have this one. But sadly, we don't have anything else. Let's go check. Okay, let's see. The boat is right there. Lone Stalkers! The bar in Zalice is open again! The first drink after the emission is on me! Okay. But. Let's get up here. Let's check it out. If there's anything. And then look around and check the map and run to the next place. <laughs> and check the PDA. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. They added the power grid. AKA the jammer. Giant metal thing. Which is well, was an actual radio jammer. Nothing can get in or out the nearby area. Not outside that broadcast, not inside that broadcast. But damn, this is looking so beautiful. Just wow. Okay, let's see how far. 500 meters, not even bad. And, uh... Okay, can we... Okay. Okay. The map. Let's open the map. Oh, the map. Lesser zone, burnt forest. Okay, an unknown location. And I'm pretty sure that the smoke area. There, yeah, there is something. Okay. Upgrades? Damn. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, let's see. Okay, I need to check that uh, uh, upgrade system later on. But hey, at least we have this pistol still, so we can actually be able to defend ourselves. Okay. Okay. And in one second I thought these guys are from me. Expecting any help? Come on over. Let's have a chat. Okay, but I'm gonna loot these guys first. Where this guy's gun is? Okay, now we have a gun. Fuck them up pretty good, eh? <laughs> I didn't expect anyone to step in for me. That's rarer than Mama's beats around here. Normally, folks in the zone just walk past other people's troubles. They've got their own shit to deal with. You are new around here, ain't ya? Okay. 
What did they want from you? What did those guys want from you? Ah, typical thug stuff. My loot, my gun, maybe my boots, if they're fancy. They are the scavengers of the zone. What else can you expect from them, eh? So, uh, Like the bandits huh? on the earlier games. I am, to be honest. Yeah, I figured as much. But you have definitely taken out a few scumbags in your day. Thanks for having my back. I might be pushing my luck here, but could you lend me a hand with something else? Okay. All right, let's hear it. There's four of us at the boiler house, not far from here. Squint, Richter, Gloomy, and myself. Squint is the leader. Richter is his right-hand man. And we just joined Spa... Uh, a group. Squint and Richter took off somewhere in the morning. And then me and Gloomy got ambushed by those bandits. I, uh... uh managed to make a tactical retreat. But the bastards took Gloomy. I don't know what they are doing to him, but I doubt they are throwing him a party. We need to rescue him and make those thugs regret it. Gloomy will find a way to return the favor. Okay. All right. I'll do it. For real? Dude, you rock. Don't worry, I won't just send you there empty-handed. I've got a stash close by. Oh, yeah. It's got everything you need. A gun, some ammo, the whole shebang. Whatever you don't use, consider it yours. Just make sure you've got Gloomy's back, all right? Okay, okay. Okay, and the stash is... Leave it over 100 meters that way, and let's... Go there. Okay, there's something inside here. Well, well, at least it's not dead bodies. Six meters. Okay. Is there a second floor somewhere in here? Nine meters. Okay, it's up there. How are we supposed to get there? Okay, I think I get where we need to Yeah. Thank you, but that was not the stats what we are looking for. Okay, 50 meters. And actually, let's do that one. Come on, spill it, jump. Where's the money? Look your eyes. That was all of them.
Okay, thank you. Let's check the guy on the upstairs. Okay. Thank you. Let's see what there is. Nice, nice, and nice. Suppressor, nice. Sadly, we can only use it to the pistols, though. Well, who sent you? Richter or that asshole Jorik? Jorik was worried about you. Jorik asked me to get you out of here. He asked you to wipe his ass, that's what he did. You think those goons were brought down here by the emission? Jorik lost a wad of cash playing cards in garbage and figured he could hide out here. Well, the fucker wasn't completely wrong. They didn't get him. They got me! What you looking at? Expecting a reward? Check the togs. I'm just glad they left me my suit. Wait a sec. They didn't take the detector! Those scumbags think they're too good to dive into anomalies looking for artifacts. Easier to shake down a loner on his way out. Assholes. Okay. Did uh, Jorik set you up? You mean Jorik set you up? Absolutely, he did. Jorik can miss a whole emission when he gets into cards. He won't stop until he loses his shirt and his underpants too. Great. It's no use blaming him, though. You wouldn't blame a flesh for grunting, would you? I wouldn't. But I might give him a good punch in the nose. Okay. Hmm. That'll do. Hand it over. Here you go. There's an anomaly in the cave. Appeared right after the emission. Maybe the detector will help you sniff something out. Thanks for the help, Stalker. But don't count on anyone standing up for you if you run into trouble. You'll be better off that way. Okay. All right, you stupid asshole. Get over here. Come You have no idea how glad I am. Why don't you come a little closer? Let me get a better idea. Uh, I've got something I need to take care of, so... Why don't you take a breather and cool off? I'll be right back. Okay, let's get to the last place where we need to go. And let's see what's gonna happen. And before anything bad happens to me, I'm gonna make a save. I'm trying to check the key bindings and find a way to get a little bit better way to save without interrupting all the time while saving. Oh, thank you. Anything else? Nothing there. Okay, that's that body. Thank you. Okay. Anything in here? Thank you. Okay, I don't think that that is the way to go down here. Ow. Okay, I think... Hold up! Okay, we need to go... Here. Get there. Okay, so maybe this way then. If I'm not totally wrong, 
this was on the earlier game, the train station. Okay, I don't think that this goes. Okay, and this one is still locked. So it's gonna be this way. Is this the bar tender? I'm looking for solder. Nope. Talk to Gaffer. That's him over there. What do you want? Sit down and stay out of sight. Three of my men never reported back from their overnight patrol around the Lesser Zone. We found their bodies by the old bridge. Hey. Soldier, over here. Now, what do you call three dead wardens up the zone's ass? A good start. <laughs> <laughs> Traitor who goes by hamster is peddling this service weapon. It belonged to one of those wardens. He got it from Squint. Apologies, Captain, but Zalicia is a free trade zone. We have an agreement with Korshov. Where is Squint? This situation kind of explodes very, very easily. Who are we to meddle in its designs? Playing a wise and stalker sage, are you? Fine. Squint was there for sure. He finished off the wounded and looted their bodies. Is that the stalker way now? Hmm. I suppose it's not that simple. I suppose it's not that simple. All right. If you won't tell me, others will. Seize them! Easy now. Nobody's going anywhere. If you don't want the innocent to suffer, find me the culprit. Okay. Well then, in times of war, the law falls silent. Hey! Stalker, must have been you here. Okay. Come over here. Let's have a chat. That's okay, how we're all see. here in Zalicia. Us maniacs are gonna drink all my vodka in the street. If anyone asks, I'm at home and busy. Anyone at all? Anyone. Don't buy into that whole dog and pony show, rookie. Gaffer's been uppity because sort of lets him. Of course, enough was here instead of him. Would have been standing against the wall already. The captain prefers a more diplomatic approach. <laughs> okay, who should I ask about Solder? So, who should I ask about Solder? Try Zodov. The ward can find anyone you want as long as you can cut a deal with them. And you're okay with their methods. No, or you could ask Gaffer. Just give him some time to get to his house. He's an easy young guy. He usually helps rookies out, but he's had to deal with a year's worth of crap today. See ya. Good luck. First drinks on the house if you need it. And I get the feeling you're gonna need it. Okay, got the deep job. I don't feel like running errands. Got anything good? You still smell like the mainland, tough guy. Feeling bold and audacious already, huh? All right. There's a guy, kind of like you, who owes me some coin. His name is Valik Lux. Now I need my money back. Okay. Sure. I can handle it. I saw him just a couple of hours ago. He headed north, towards the water tower. I don't want his blood on my hand. Just scare the kid, shake him down, and get my money. And that's it. 20% is yours. Okay. You know, when I opened this bar, I never... Back in the day, it was just me and the gaffer. If the ward stopped bugging us, that'd be awesome. But... Okay, let's see. 
Let's ask about uh, what's in New York around the side. Gaffer is a good man. I've been with him since we made our way here from the Cordon. We took on the monolith of the Sphere together. I helped him defend Elise and got this bar up and running. But there's one thing he doesn't quite get, stubborn old fool. Risking everyone to save one guy is gonna get you all killed. But he is still willing to risk it all. Here, I serve the Wardens just as well as I serve Loners. Because I've learned my lesson. And the Gaffer's gonna learn it too, sooner or later. No. If you need oh. anything, stop by. Okay. Need a drink? So Here's what I got. Okay. Well, okay, you don't have that much stuff. Hmm. Can we... Oh, we can't sell this one. That's sad. Hmm. But one thing what we can actually do is... Of course... Unload the guns. So we can get some ammo. But sadly, you don't have anything that you don't need. Right if you now. need anything, stop by. Okay, one more thing what I wanna check out if. Can we sleep in here? Okay, I. Okay, we can put it off. Okay. Hey, stalker! Come over here, rookie! We need to talk! <laughs> Okay. Okay, can we interact? Well, join Stalker from the Campfire Gossip. But now it's time to say thank you for watching, and I know that this video is over, over long. But everybody who has been watching this first episode of Stalker 2, thank you. And an uh, artifact as always, real bad. all links it's called the and Night social media down below in the I description. And if you haven't subscribed, hit subscribe button, hit the notification bell on so, so you don't miss any upcoming videos. And check this other place, come in the screen right now.